On a sunny day in July of 2015, four-year-old Dickie Donnelly and his parents are enjoying a vacation at Zoom Beezlebub Big Ass Roller Coaster City Theme Park in Sandusky, Ohio. At 10.16 a.m., security footage shows the family purchasing two turkey legs and three cups of coffee. At 11.05 a.m., they ride the Disney copyright-free knockoff ride Splish Mountain Range. At 2.44 p.m., they spend a long time in the restroom because did you hear what they had for breakfast? It was turkey and coffee. But here's where things take a turn. At 3.15 p.m., the boy and his parents board the upside-down Brampton Dino Dump Holy Crab Custy Roller Coaster. When it first begins its clicky-clacky ascent up the first big hill, every seat is filled. But just two minutes and ten seconds later, when the coaster comes screeching to a halter, one seat is empty. The safety bar, still down, locked into place. His parents still strapped in on either side. And Dickie Donnelly? Nowhere to be found. Where had he gone? With no evidence of blood or disgusting guts on the concrete below, there was no sign he'd fallen. Had he simply puffed into dust and evapopoofered into thin air? Now, all these years later, I have the story and know exactly what happened to him in excruciating detail. How do I know? I am him. From Earwolf Presents, in combination with the Sandusky Police Department and Mothers Against Big Chunky Kidnappers of Chickeny Little Kids, this is the disappearance of Dickie Donnelly. Dickie Donnelly.